Greetings, everybody. How you doing today? Welcome to my channel here on YouTube. Rob K Reacts. Oasis. Channel specifically for the band that I love, known as Oasis. Where I'm currently putting out a video once every Sunday, which isn't good enough for me. Uh, I'm trying to get more done, but I have a new system coming, a new internet modem coming to increase my speed. So I'm running on very minimal right now. Um, I can't go four days without making videos. So I'm just doing a few to get through until hopefully I, everything shows up tomorrow. It all looks like it's tracking for tomorrow so it was supposed to be friday but now i went through the weekend but nonetheless we are rocking and rolling once again with oasis and with the new system setup coming i will be streaming i'm going to be doing a specific oasis stream uh for request only soon uh once this channel hits a thousand subs i will be doing a stream where it's just like a two-hour stream of just oasis request baby and looking forward to that so let's keep rolling let's get it to a thousand subs if we can because i want to Die in the stream again with Oasis on YouTube, and I have a format. Uh, it's going to be audio only, but at least we can enjoy it big time, man. Outstanding. Looking forward to it. We are. I just finished up, I believe, the last album of their jur uh, journey of making records albums. Uh, I believe this here is the last single they may have released. I caught in a comment. Can you verify that if you can? I thought it'd be a great time to roll with this right after the album. Uh, but I don't know what this falling down is on the images. Is this maybe the B side because the channel's from a B uh, from a channel B side remixes or something. But hopefully it's all good. Uh, who gave me this? Let me check Discord real quick. Oh, this was Buccarado. Okay, thanks for the link on that. My Oasis request channel, my Discord. Let's roll Oasis. Oh, swollen hand blues. So I'm guessing it's going to be of a blues tune, and I hear it's very Beatles oriented sound wise. So let's check it out. Give me an info you can on this if it is verified as their last official single they released. Um, and the falling down. Not familiar with that. I don't think. It's already. Wow, very different. Wow, I gotta back that up. So I, I'm just thinking about. I read a comment because uh, I was verifying the song title, and one of the top comments was stating about, yeah, the band has uh, from the masses of people that enjoyed them, gave them that Beatle uh, sound comparison, uh, and people are. This comment was like, yeah, but it took until like 2009 for them <laughs> to actually do a tune that really sounded like a Beatles tune. Which is what I'm hearing here. Like, yeah, I've heard a couple of their other tunes. that had little snippets, little sounds, you know, other than the, the covers they did. But this was very strong for me, Beatle related, man. My God, it was just, definitely could have been a Beatles tune. Wow. Had I not known it was Oasis, man, I would have, I would have went, got thrown for a loop there without a doubt. But I just found that interesting. <laughs>
Yeah, there's another pause for the cause. I'm backing it up because I'm thinking again something I wanted to mention also. So this week I've been something I'm working on for the channel uh, with the new setup coming is I'm trying to find my favorite version of cigarettes and alcohol. It roared, you know, cigarette, that tune's been with me from the first time I heard it in my top five. It was like a top three. Boom, it's been number one for a while, and it's going to probably be number one for a long time, I think. You know, there's still a bunch of stuff I need to hear. Um, so this week I've been here listening to all the different versions, trying to find my favorite version. And when I find my favorite version, I'm going to do a reaction, a review on it here. So that, that'll be coming soon, too. So just something I want to throw out there, because that tune is just so powerful. And, you know, just from the first time I, I, I saw the title, the first main road show that I did on Twitch live stream a year and a half ago. And I saw the title, Cigarettes and Alcohol. Without even hearing the tune, I knew I was going to love it because I came from a background that was fucking surrounded by cigarettes and alcohol. I wore $1,000 suits, man, every night in the nightclub, strip club. Fucking every night I come home, they stink cigarettes and alcohol. So yeah. It's gonna be hard to replace that tune because there's a there's a there's a well, what's the word? There's an affliction of it between the two. There's a connection between the two without even knowing the song. I, I loved it by the title because I lived it. I lived that title by being smelling like fucking cigarettes and all. I had a big time. Lot man, listen, my dry cleaning bill on my suits and shit was so expensive. I had to get the club. The club paid for it. It was like 500 bucks a month, man, just to clean my suits and stuff to get rid of that cigarette and alcohol smell. By God, and how am I rolling with that now? 35 years later, man. Well, I retired from that 2004. Whew. Great. Well, that's my thing on cigarettes and alcohol. Big part as to why it's number one for me. Let's go. So a very much different style of a tune from the band Oasis that I love. I enjoyed it, big time. But had I heard it for the first time not knowing it was an Oasis tune, I might have thought it was a Beatles tune. Easily. Now it looks like I got my light figured out on this side. It was always pixely here. I think I got it figured out, man. I'm really happy about that. Outstanding. Wow. Okay, man. Once again, yeah, let me know about this falling down. Because that looks like an album cover graphic. Let me know. Is there another album I need to check out? Or am I that old and stone and forgetful that I fucking forgot I, just, I did that whole thing? Let me know, man. I'm just getting ready for my new system, man. I've been cleaning this system out. This system I'm on right now is becoming a streaming computer. My new one's more of a gaming computer. So I'll be using an Elgato capture card to really stream at a high, higher level. Um, so I'm fine and cleaning this out and then i'm you know of course i'm gonna get the new one i gotta download everything i need to put on it but nonetheless outstanding if i can network it properly but oasis once again man those swollen hand blues and like i said promise 1000 subs in this channel we start a live stream we'll have some fun with that because i like live stream on youtube right now my main channel and it's just a crazy mix of everything but if i do the live stream out of this channel oasis channel and it's a different ball game all oasis baby okay so i can't do that till i get a thousand subs so, so let's get Make that happen if we can, and we'll roll with that. I'm looking forward to a two-hour review, two-hour session of just Oasis only, baby. Can't wait. My friends, hope you enjoyed that. Those Swollen Hand Blues, great song. It wasn't bluesy at all for me. It was more beatle for me than it was anything blues for me, but nonetheless, enjoyed it. Always great hearing something new from these guys. It gets me thinking about my past, and that's outstanding. Didn't hear them then, but yeah, I get to hear them now. Okay, guys, got to roll. That's it for the day. I'll be back tomorrow. Have a great day. Love you all, man. Try to get back on Wednesday here. Uh, with another another reaction in the channel if i can get my pc tomorrow and set up and rock and roll and we'll be rolling have a great day love you all man you know what's up take care